all right so moving on after this pumpkin festival collection all right so after the pumpkin festival so bad and body words they do had a celebration collection before the year end of 2016 so those are the all right so the scents that i'm talking about are one of them is the wrap in sugar so this is how you um the packaging is good and i like the ribbon the actual you know um glitter and the actual label itself and then they do have a cocktail dress so it's the same package it's just a different color it's at the back it show bat and body works and then they do had a pink confetti so once again um pink confetti and then the last one is the champagne toast so once again champagne toast the the cold one so let's check out how uh, what this smells like okay so for the wrap in sugar so once again wrap in sugar top notes are sparkling mandarin touch of apple coconut cosmo martini accord uh, mid notes heliotrope sheer jasmine toasted coconut flakes and then dry notes are marshmallow musk amber and warm woods so let's check it out Um, first scent, I smell the coconut scents. Um, I believe these are the coconut Cosmo Martini Accord. It smells really good. Um, this one is also good for summer. I, I love it. Um, the coconut itself, marshmallow mass, yes, warm woods, and this is a must buy. All right, so the second celebration collection is the pink confetti. So once again, this is a pink confetti. It says top notes, um, Cassie's leaves. I don't know what that is. And then William Pear, uh, Pear. And then pink strawberry. Mid notes are apricot nectar, sparkling jasmine, um, peony petals, which means this is uh, flowery. Dry notes are creamy vanilla, marshmallow, um, bourbon woods, and crystallized musk. So let's check. Mm, it smells good. The strawberry scents, when you first spray, there's um, first thing that you distinguish. Creamy vanilla, I smell the creamy vanilla as well as the marshmallow and the burn burn wood so i believe pink strawberry and the burn bourbon woods are almost smells like the same so this one also is good uh really good so the third one third one is a champagne toast so once again it's a champagne toast top notes are vintage champagne sparkling tangerine mid notes are red hibiscus white nectarine um, black currant Campboard juicy passion fruit. Dry notes are plum wood, sugared mass, and vanilla extra. Smells good. Okay. Vintage champagne. Yeah, with a twist of sparkling tangerine or tangerine. It's a good combination. This is my top one. Uh, or my top um scents i believe and next one is the pink confetti let's check out what it smells like of this uh cocktail dress it says top notes crisp pomegranate osmanthus i don't know what that is and then also there's a sparkling mandarin mid notes uh peony petals so i believe this one is a flowery scent as well lily of the valley and juicy pear and then dry notes slick amber woods skin moss and sheer uh, cedar woods so it's now
this smells unique. I haven't I haven't smells like this. But it's not that really like perfume. It's not long lasting unlike the tree. So these are the um, celebration collection. So once again, wrap in sugar, pink confetti, champagne toast, and a cocktail dress. So these four are the celebration connections. So let's go ahead and move on to the next one. All right. So after that um, celebration collection, Body Body Works, they do had release um, new springs collections, and some of them are repackaged. But I was able to get the new um, scents. And I have here the warm coconut blossom. I have the sweet tropical vanilla and the repackage of the co Amazon rain. Um, the other stuff I wasn't able to get it, like the fresh Brazil citrus. That one is repackaged. And then the um, what else? The pink um, fashion fruit. Um, kiss so those two I wasn't able to get but I have the old packaging for the fresh um, Brazil citrus okay so I'm moving on to the scent okay so for the warm coconut blossom the top notes are white peach uh, beach blossom mid notes are island orchid plum nectar and the dry notes are coconut butter, sandalwood musk. So let's check it out. The sandalwood itself and musk combination, as well as the coconut, also is a legit smell. So this one also good for summer. And then the next one is the sweet tropical vanilla. All right, so for the sweet tropical vanilla. Um, top notes are sparkling tangerine, tropical vanilla. Mid notes are dulce de leche, terra flower. And then dry notes are vanilla cake, sugared woods, and fluffy mass. So this mm, smells really sweet. The actual vanilla cake itself. And the combination of dulce de leche is really awesome. I, I like this one. It's a fruity scent. It smells like cake. Okay, and the last but not the least I have for the collection is the Cool Amazon Rain. So top notes are Amazon Rain, Juicy Mandarin, Brazilian Star Fruit. Mid notes are Pinky, Cyclamen, Coconut Blossom, uh, Frank Japani. Um, Cattleya Orchid, Trumpet, um, Jasmine, and then Dry Notes, uh, Dewy Bamboo, White, Driftwood, Palm Leaf, and Moss. So let's check it out. I had already smelled this because I have the old packaging, but um, this one smells fresh and it's really good. So these are my top favorites. So this is the second one and then the warm uh, coconut blossom. So these are a must have as well so after this collection um bad and body works they had a spring another spring collection which has a uh, it came with a natural oil all right so the scents that i'm talking about uh one of them is the jasmine and green apple with natural uh, jasmine oil next one is the lavender and sandalwood with as well the natural lavender oil and then the third one they have the wild berry and chamomile with a natural tea oil and then the last is the almond and vanilla with a natural almond oil so let's check out what's the smell Okay, so with a jasmine and green tea apple, 
uh, the fragrance says the refreshing blend of dewy honeysuckle, green apple, and natural jasmine extract. So that smells um, how it smells like. Uh, but I do love the packaging though for this collection. Yeah. It, it smells. Smells so like fresh uh, when you're outside like a garden um for sure um you know full of um full of fresh um green leaves that's how it smells like to me i love it so the next one is to wild berry and chamomile all right so for the wild berry and chamomile it says a fresh mix of white ginger Wild blackberry and natural tea oil. Oh yeah, this one's um, I used this already, and this one is really relaxing. Uh, I love the scents. And then going on to the ner uh, to the third one is the lavender and sandalwood. All right, so for the lavender and sandalwood, it says a warm blend of magnolia petals of sandalwood and natural lavender oil so this is more of relaxing sense to me I believe this is because of the lavender um, effects so this one is really good as well and the last one which is my top favorite of all the almond and vanilla with natural oil all right so it says a soft fleece Sweet blend of white orchid, vanilla, absolute, and natural almond tea oil. So this one is really a subtle scent and a really clean scent for me. So again, these are my top favorite. The second is the lavender. Third is the wild berry chamomile. And then the green um, jasmine and green apple extract. So try all of this. Um, these are good smells. Right, so before I end this video review about the Bad and Bunny Works fragrance mist and body care, um, I do had the old collection for summer, which is the Oahu Coconut Sunset. This one is really amazing. It's almost half. So they do repackage this year. So it's the same scent. I believe a sense a warm sensual blend of perfect Oahu Sunset and a lyric scent of coconut blossom so I, I really love this scent and I cannot wait or I can't wait to get my restock for this one so thank you so much for watching and sorry about the background noise a while ago and I appreciate you for your patience watching this uh, review again this is Jeffy and see you on, an, on my next video thank you